Okay, now this one, <coughs> pardon me, is about the RSS, the dreaded RSS file. This is a file that has been created by iWeb to direct um, podcast servers like iTunes um, to where your um, podcast is. Now, we haven't done one on a podcast yet, but we are going to do one very soon. So let's just assume we've made a podcast. Um, and we're going to have a look at what the um, structure of the RSS file is. So to do that, we need to go to iDisk. We need to go to Web. Here's the um, web files we've opened before. Actually, something I forgot to mention in the last one was there is another index HTML at the root level. And that'll take you off to uh, to the main site that you're going to. Um, so there's another route. So that actually takes you off to the index HTML and test site because that's the one I've got set up as my main site. Uh, anyway, I think that's the way it works. Um, a bugger, and there's another one here as well. So um, there's a few redirects, but they're all redirects, so they don't have anything on them. Okay, so anyway, the RSS site's most important, so we're going to go to web. Now, the test site that we did doesn't actually have yet a podcast on it, so uh, we, we will make one, but I wanted to do that. I'm going to have to do a garage band, and I want to show you that as a separate set or series, which I'll probably do this afternoon. But um, let's have a look. I had a request for, for what the hell's going on with my RSS from a wonderful person in America, or Canada, I think. It was. Anyway, one of those sort of, you know, places on the other side of the globe. God, what a terrible thing. I just got the two confused. <coughs> I'll probably be hung, drawn and courted for it, but still um, might be some enjoyment in that. So we'll have a look at um, <laughs> this one. Let's have a look at an, R at an RSS file. Now there's, first of all, the structure of the RSSs. <coughs> Pardon me. Each podcast will have its own RSS file. Uh, and I think each blog does too, but I'm going to come to that when I do blogs specifically. Now let's assume they do for the moment. If they don't, I shall correct myself when you see a tutorial on how to make a blog. Um, now, when you open each one, you'll see that there's an RSS file. Now, it's pretty simple to uh, open these. All you do is, <coughs> pardon me, grab hold of them, drag it down to text, edit, let go. Now, it takes a little while to open because it's coming from a long way away. And there, in all its glory, is your RSS file. I'm just extending it down my 20-inch screen here. So, now, that's the lot of it. There's not actually that much to it. It's not that bad in terms of, uh, of language, but... Um, I'm just going to show you the structure <coughs> because there's there's a couple of sections to it which are important. And if you read the technical blurb on what uh, you need to have, you will find that these things uh, need to be done and uh, need to be understood. One of them is, and I'm just going to turn push them into into by using spaces, which shouldn't really be there. I think they work with spaces, but I'm not dead sure. It's probably best not to have the space anyway. Hi, it's me. I had to uh, cut this video in half, okay, so the other half is number two. So um, go on to the next page or look for it on YouTube. There, it's number two, the same thing. Okay, bye.